Hello everybody, Swift here again with another backpack here run. And what do we got today? Yes, the new character Toad. Banished by the Elder Frogs, her backpack is blessed by a dreaming tree. Magical carvings spawn each turn, she's in danger. So let's go. Now, her unique mechanic is this part over here. The, the carvings, a wooden buckler, uh, whatever this is, and tree sword. So what these do, I'm gonna explain in a moment. But for now, we're gonna get a 10 max HP and off to the first area. I'm gonna go to the easy area because I know it better and I think it's easier. And um, yeah, let's hope for the best. Now, if you want to play this, you have to have access to the Steam version through the Kickstarter, and you also have to be in the beta branch, the testing branch. So, first of all, let's get rid of the first fights here real quick, because, um, yeah, with those, we have a problem. But the first mechanic she has, if you didn't already see, I started with one energy, and I'm gonna have two energy. She has scaling energy. And next turn, I'm gonna have three energy. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. And next, after that, I'm gonna have five. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. I mean, right now, I have four. But yeah, after that, I'm going to have five. Now, let me start explaining a couple of things. These things over here, which are refreshed every turn, are um, things I can use. They are like a deck. Let's go here, here, and these two. There is a, an important reason why I'm doing that. Let's get the piggy bank because we're lucky. Let's get money because it's useful. And let's get energy, I guess, because energy is energy. I can take one more item. Uh, is there a key here? I need a key. I don't really need a key. That's a fake door. Let's go with this and uh, we're gonna go continue fighting. I'm gonna go to these in a moment because I still have not explained the main mechanic of this character. But we found the Crimson Energy, which is really important. Let's take the Crimson Energy or or this thing or this thing. Okay, I, I perfect. Perfect. Let's take two damage right away and I'm gonna come back here. Wait a minute, I do have money. Let's roll the coinage. Come on, give me either the energy or the scimitar. Yes, I found the scimitar. Very nice. Scimitar is the best weapon for this character. So let's get the scimitar. I'm super happy. The scimitar, what it does is it, is it does some damage. And when an adjacent or diagonal item is destroyed, this gets plus one damage. It's combat. That's important because this character does destroy items. Now, let me maybe showcase here what's happening, actually. So first of all, let's drink this to, to eat. And now this scimitar does 10 damage. So um, first of all, I, as you see, as I told you, have less energy. So, let's say, let's start with a deck. Over here, all the time, I get three or four items. I don't know what exactly dictates how many items I draw. But these items are one-use items that uh, get refreshed into the deck. So, this, for example, we have the wooden buckler here that says can be played over other items. So, I can just pull it and play it wherever. As you see, it does cost one energy. And this, for example, also costs one energy. And this specifically says on use adds one block. But for each empty space in this column, this gets plus four blocks. So, if I play it here, it's going to get one block from itself. And then four block from here and four block from here. Nine block in general. This uh, functions in a similar manner. On use, deals two damage, and for each empty space to the right, it gets plus one damage. So if I place it here, it's gonna do two damage from itself, and then another two damage from these two empty spaces. So that's a four damage weapon. But if I put it here and it still does the same, uh, it will power up the scimitar. Same as go with the shield. If I press the shield here, if I put the shield here, it's gonna pop the scimitar. So I'm gonna reorganize the moment. But for now, we're gonna just pop it here. Actually, I shouldn't even pop it here because this has the ability to be placed above other things. I should pop it here so that it gets one block from itself and then four and four, eight and another four, 12. That's 13 blocks. So let's use it. Boom, as you see, we've got 13 block because it counted all those. And I can just start attacking. And the last item that I currently have in my inventory is the helmet, which I didn't draw right now, but let's go poop another 13 block, smack. As you see, our energy is slowly scaling. Now we have three. Uh, pop a 13 shield, smack, smack. In general, I want to have an as empty spots as possible. Uh, let's go with shield and pop. <laughs> I still haven't drawn the helmet, which I want to showcase. By the way, the draws seem to be random. I seem to have two helmets in the deck. So the helmet does the following, that's five block. And then it's banished. And it also does not have the ability of being placed wherever you want. But, but, if it's at the, it's, if, and also I have to place at the very top. Otherwise, it doesn't even give me the block. But it's a zero thing. So I put this and this. And uh, as you see, I still have five energy. So that's the upside of the helmet. Banished means currently for the current, for the specific current um, fight. So let's go four spaces sideways because I want to have one big line downwards for the shields and then I want to have as many to the left and right for the swords. So let's do that. I got a better shield than the one I had so I don't have to deal any more with that. With um, I don't have to deal anymore with the room provided and let's also go with this for energy and this for even more armor. And, uh, well, now the plan is the following. This line is gonna be empty, and this line is gonna be empty. It's, like, gonna be a cross. And the only things that we don't care about is here, here, and here, and here, for example. 
which uh, right now I don't have. That's why, by the way, the reason I didn't go to those over here is because these are going to give us carvings. Whenever you see that symbol, it's a guaranteed carvings only. So let's see what new carving we're going to add to our deck. Survival guide. For zero, remove three from all stats effects on enemies. And for each mana stone in this row, this item gets minus one to all stats effects. I guess minus one means that it's four, five, six, and seven. You know, I, I guess it means that it removes even more and not less. Uh, that's decent. Acorn cup for one can be played over other items and adds four block. And adjacent shields gets plus four block as combat. So you pop it here and this shield permanently gets plus four block. I mean, you would pop it here so that the, um, the scimitar also gets the boost. Because whenever I pop something and it explodes, the scimitar gets a permanent damage boost for the fight. I mean, not permanent for the fight. Mossy carving can be played over other items. Uh, for zero, by the way. On use deals one damage. Adjacent consumables are destroyed. Okay, that's not always good. For each adjacent consumable, this item gets plus 10 damage. Well, this is adjacent, so that means it can hit up to 4. So that's, this does up to 40 damage by 41 damage by destroying 4 consumables. Sawmill. For 0, it can be played over other items. On use, this item... What? The item this is played on is destroyed. Okay, that's not good. Uh, unless you play it on a consumable. Adds 1 energy for each space destroyed item occupied. Okay, so you can pick up random trash items, for example, the quadruple shield, and throw this up, up to the quadruple shield and just gives you four energy. This is good as an idea. Like, you can pick trash items, like, as I said, you, you can pick, for example, a knight shield and just shove it over there and then throw this onto the, the shield and then poop, you get two energy out of it. This is good. I enjoy this as an idea. I enjoy this, although it's going to be a dead draw after you destroy whatever items you want to destroy with this. So, it has an upside and a downside. I don't like any of these, honestly speaking. Like, the acorn cap is good and all, but at the end of the day, I want to be using the bucklers for shielding, as they already shield me for... Uh, the maximum amount these can shield me is 1, plus uh, 4 times 4 is 16. So, this is a 17 shield, if uh, if this whole row is empty, which is very powerful, and this is never going to catch up to that. I think I'm going to get the sawmill and try to uh, try to destroy things. I want to I wanna see that, how it would function. And then she also has her own shop, which uh, you can use to, first of all, remove carvings for a price. So make your deck, min-max your deck, for example. Although you have to go to the shop while you have a decent hand that you want to throw away. And then she also sells her own things, which is... Well, what is she selling? First of all, all of them cost 10, no matter the rarity. Can be played over other items. Unused deals 1 damage. For each empty space to the right, this gets plus 2 damage. Oh, and it's a 0 cost. So if I play it here... It's a zero damage, let's say this whole empty row, one, and then three, five, seven, nine, eleven damage. And if I have even more room, then it's even more for zero, by the way. This is really good. Uh, pot carving for one energy, draw two car carvings. Yeah, this is if we go full on deep into carvings. And poison carving, add zero poison to enemy. And then uh, for each consumable in this row, this gets plus three to poison. Um, okay, for its consumable, I mean, you can do a consumable build, but I don't know. Uh, I would enjoy gaining pot carvings and wood shifts. Like, um, I, I want to get like a carving deck going. Although, obviously, I have no idea if it's going to be any good or not. But uh, we're going to keep that in mind and we're going to continue moving. I would also enjoy gaining the Crimson Energy here, but I need the money for the carvings, I guess. Let's see what we find here. Okay, we found our uh, thing that I wanted. <laughs> we found our uh, destroy this to gain energy. <laughs> Go on. I could pick up more things to destroy them to gain energy. Honestly speaking. Okay, here it is. Sawmill. Boop. Three energy. Nice. Love it. Okay, we can go here, here, and here, and here. Also use this. And now theoretically, I have already enough energy to destroy. And I also have enough defense to destroy. Pass. The very left thing is never an issue because I can play the sword here, for example. Boop, as you see, seven damage. Although I would obviously prefer putting them here. 17 shielding as you saw so yeah i want to put the shields here i want to do this whenever i can because i want to make the this thing more powerful by the way banishing does not count for that uh that was me just showcasing how this whole thing works okay uh this is seven block this is eight block i'm thinking about throwing the knight's shield away let's take the slash shield i'm gonna keep the sawmill uh, no, I mean, I'm not going to keep this for so long. What is this? Is a new drink? Mug of grape juice. Replace it with an empty cup. On use, draw one carving. Okay, for zero. Okay, this is a carving item. Might as well take it. Why not? Let's go next fight. Okay. 
I guess we go first of all with energy, 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 throw it away, throw this away too. And let's go, boop, dead, boop, 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 still alive, and we won. When I say still alive, I mean dead. Uh, we go here and here, I would guess, so I'm trying to spread out the line. We found a shiv, we found a liquid armor, might as well put this here and this here. We're most likely going into boss fight, I think. Tuning for free defense might be a good idea. Let's see what we find here, first of all. Want no. Okay, so I have 13 money, 13 coinage. I can either go for max life or for another carving. I think I'm gonna go for the shiv. I enjoy the shiv. So if I play the shiv here, for example, it's gonna be 1, uh, 3, 5, 7, uh, 9, 11, uh, 13, 15 damage. 15 damage shiv right now if I place it there. I don't think I can. I have another spin. Yeah, I don't have another spin. It cost like 6. So it is what it is. Good thing we got the piggy bank early because we will need money for the carving. So let's see a new carving here. What are these? So first of all, we got overgrown arrow. Can be played over other items. Unused arrows behind. Get harm and bonus damage this turn. Behind means whatever is obviously behind. Uh, so if I played here and both of these were arrows, then that means for that specific turn, my arrows would do double damage. Which sounds good, but it costs one energy. So I'm not sure if it's actually good. I mean, it is actually good because if you're gonna do uh, use one energy to do, you know, ten damage, then might as well uh, two. If you're using, gonna use two, uh, well, it's good anyway. <laughs> if you use two energy to do ten damage twice, well, you can use this plus one energy to do twenty damage. That sounds to be the same, but if you have five energy, for example, then obviously this is better. Um, sharp branch for one energy. Adjacent weapons get plus four damage this combat. Uh, I don't know. Sounds good, but... So, you're, I'm gonna use one energy to just pass a turn. I mean, this is, by the way, 5 damage, this combat, because this already has plus damage combat when something gets destroyed. So, if I play it here, I guess if I play it here, then, um, yeah, this is gonna gain 5 damage. So, for one energy, plus 5 damage on the weapon. I don't know. I prefer the for one energy shield and then also plus 1 damage. Yeah, I don't want any of these. I don't know what to say. Uh, just... Just go. Let's see what you have. No. No. Whoa, the angel wings. Okay. The curse was behind. Who <laughs> thought was lucky? Okay, the angel wings was, was the only thing I cared about. And mostly because I wanted the money. So, uh, let's see what the shop is selling. Nothing of importance. People are telling me to keep this to remove curses. As if that would save us. The problem with the curse is that, especially shadow. Like, I have been told that... Uh, take the charmed bracelet to be able to defeat the shadow, the, the living shadow fight. As if the problem with the living shadow fight is the curse, it's, uh, the, the curse itself. The problem is that the curse is too big and destroys your run. The problem with that curse is not the curse itself. It's it's not getting cursed. It, it, the problem is picking up the curse, not that it's unremovable. And we got two wooden shivs, although I only have one wooden shiv. Okay, this is literally proof that you can draw the same item two or three times. Let's go shiv attack. Kaboom, seven. And kaboom, seven. Okay, I need to open up a bit of space. Obviously. Uh, let's go smack. I can do this, for example. And I can do this too. Nice, 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 nice. I, I really enjoy this whole uh, deck aspect of this. Okay. <laughs> I really enjoy the this thing. Let's go here to do go through that. This is money. This is a consumable. This is also a consumable. Yeah, I mean, this is money, this is energy. You know what? Actually, let's do this. And uh, I can do that thing. Let's go here. Take my money. And when I say take, I mean give me. By the way, people were telling me about I was using mods and they're not. Uh, they're going to stop watching me because I use mods. This, first of all, is three energy right now. Um, yeah, power to you, man. Power to you guys. You can do whatever you want. I can also do whatever I want. And uh, at the end of the day... Uh, you missed the mark where I was saying that I'm gonna stop using mods the moment a new character drops. So, um, yeah, there's that. Let's go blocking. Actually, there was no reason. No, there was a reason to block. Smack. That's also one, two. This is three uses. So, I'm gonna keep the one last use here. So that I can it for five energy. For two energy, actually. Or not. Shield. Boom. Nine. Mm, yeah, nine is not enough. Let's shield another one. Pass. Up. Up. Okay, I found the shiv. You know what? Forget the zzzz. Let's go shiv. Let's go not. Wait, is this? Empty space to the right. Yeah, okay, that's night. Up, oh, nine damage, and you're dead. You can also go do this. Four damage. Uh, I need to set these things up better. I need to open up one spot here so I can have the cement tower over here because I'm dropping most of the weapons on the left. 
Uh, I guess we get the free shield. I guess we got the good shield. And then we smack smack. Now, obviously, the shield might not be that useful right now. But it will be useful at some point. So that's why I'm keeping it around. Let's also do this. The mug. And uh, yeah, let's go. Next fight, small rod wolf times three. Should have this. Okay. <laughs> I really enjoy that thing. Okay, let's get rid of the one that's trying to attack us. Let's get rid of the next one. Let's get rid of the last one. I mean, he's still alive. This is the, my main objective here. Having such a small deck. Here, assassinate. Kaboom, nine damage. You know, energy. Energy, I mean, not energy, but whatever. And uh, do I want lucky rings? No, I don't want to make my deck worse. I want my deck to be as efficient as possible. Let's go. Sable, I don't think you're going to survive this. One, two... Hop, 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 eat, hop, nice. Okay, I found the little buckler, and this is 8 block. You know what? I think having one shield is good, but at least it has to be as small as possible. And we found a legendary to sell, and we found a rare to sell. Nice, let's go sell those. I want the money for that thing, obviously. Here you go, here you go. And now I have so much money that I can literally buy a carving of my choice. What do you have? <laughs> Even more wooden shivs. I want the wooden shivs, honestly. I want the Let's take the wooden shivs. Buy this. Buy this. Okay, now we have three wooden shivs in our deck. So that means... Let's buy a shield. Maybe she's gonna give us... Because who cares about the weapons? I mean, it's a good shield. <laughs> it's a good shield. But I don't think I can sell it, right? He only accepts three weapons. Yeah, okay. So, um, let's, uh, let's go. Let's go these away. Okay, we got not that much good. Okay, these need to go down, by the way. I, I don't have them in good spots. 15 damage incoming. Let's shield. Okay, we shielded everything. Very nice. Yeah, the shield is also not used. used. Little buckle is also not useful. Uh, let's have these in this way so that the shivs in the middle will get through and do a bunch of damage. Uh, you can go here, for example. Yeah, like this line is the shiv line. This line is the shield line. Now let's go here. I don't think I need anything else, honestly speaking. Yep, let's go. Let's get the max health. Nice. And I think this build is slowly coming together. Although I'm not exactly sure what's going to happen here at the boss fight. The crypt finale. Took me 17 minutes to arrive. It's a bit of a slower uh, character. Oh! Uh, replaces by illusory duct tape. Okay, I'm gonna assume that illusory duct tape is a duct tape that stays for the rest of the combat. This is insane, but I don't need it. Like, my build does not benefit from a duct tape in any way, shape, case, form, whatever you want to call it. So let's go even more wooden shifts. And I want to now start finding the thing that says draw two carvings. Uh, she's not selling anything in this. This survival guide, re-up. This is a wooden shiv. I'm gonna add that to the deck. I'm gonna have like a million wooden shivs. I'm gonna be like defense. Sh shiv, shiv, shiv. Let's go buckler too. And let's go. I want a defense and shiv build only. And also card draw. Okay, we got three shivs. <laughs> let's go. Uh, yeah, shiv. 11. 11. 11. Mm, I guess we definitely want to shield once. Let's go smack, smack. Do I even want to smack with this? A damage weapon? I mean, yeah, we're, we're shielding anything, everything anyway. Okay, let's go with a big shield. And then we're gonna go with Shiv. 11. Smack. Nice. Slow and steady wins the race. Good shield. Shiv. Uh, attack, attack. 17 shielding. I mean, 1 energy, 17 shielding. That's a lot. It's not completely busted, but it's pretty powerful. I just need to get 1 level. Nice. So now the shiv is going to be here. The, the scimitar is going to be in this line. Actually, I want this. The scimitar here and the shiv back here. So the shiv gets one more damage through this. The scimitar goes closer. It becomes more powerful. Yeah, let's go. I just realized something. I made a mistake. I, I need a line of shields like in this or here. Yeah, th there is an issue. <laughs> there are some issues happening in general. I, I could also do this, which is a lot worse. This is adjacent or diagonal, so I can... Oh, I can do this, I can do this. And I can just play the shield uh, literally on the scimitar, and it's gonna get the adjacency bonus by the fact that it also covers this spot. I think this is the best spot for the scimitar, uh, by far. Uh, none of these are useful. I guess maybe the shield spirit works. If the shield spirit works with a wooden buckler, then it's gonna be really good, obviously. So let's try this. 
Mm, let's see. Was there anything here that I actually cared about? No, not really. Let's go here to the bottom again. Uh, I guess a rare we can sell it instantly if I get the chance. Yeah, by having it here. Actually, it doesn't even affect anything here because I can still drop the shiv on top of it. As the shiv says that can be placed over other items. So this is literally a free item. Uh, energy, and this is not needed. This is uh, consumable. I can take it. And this is also all of these are consumables. I can just use them all. Let's go. Next fight. So first, first uh, encounter was pretty decent. Let's see the next ones. Uh, this is better here. Okay, now I literally am not affecting the shivs at all. I just need to get rid of these two and we're going to be good to go. Armadillo Crossbowman, Crossbowman and Red Slime. Uh, I th think the Red Slime is easier. As long as I do enough damage turn one. Boop, boop. Uh, shiv attack. Okay, test the shield theory. Okay, the shield theory works. Good to know. Uh, there was a mistake though. This thing is gonna die from I don't have yeah. From what did it die? From poison. Okay, so the shield has to drop here, and it does not get used when it drops there though. Oh, it does get used because it lost the defense it had. Yeah, and I'm still gaining the 17. Perfect. And this is buffing. Yeah, this is still buffing. It says scimitar buff eight times. Nice, 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 nice. So everything is perfect. Everything is perfect. Um, I don't want to this fight because we have already won. But the next one. <laughs> Let's go here and here. And also here. All of these will get destroyed on use. I can also take this for a zzzz, but <laughs> I don't think so. Let's see what other carving we can add to the deck. Okay, I found the pot carving, which is, as I said, draw two carvings, which I think is good. One energy to draw two. I mean, it, it itself it gets removed, for, so that means that it's drawing one in reality. So, it's not really the best thing in the world. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to continue adding shifts to the deck as long as I have the possibility to do that. Or do I want to draw more carvings? I want to draw more carvings. I want to get a, a, a cyclone going. Okay, we got our first in the right moment. You can go first. I mean, I could have sold that, but whatever. Let's use these two. Let's use this one. Uh, let's get rid of the curse. Okay, here you go, and here you go. Nice. Got him. Got them both. Nice. Bum bum. Very quick and efficient. Uh, this is uh, more dodging region. Yeah, might as well. I'm going to use it right away. This can go here, and this can go here for another. <laughs> I really enjoy that as a system. Okay, I want to... Well, I want to sell the shield. This is selling me another shiv. Let's buy the shiv continue let's go shopping oh now i have swords here by the way this is a legendary um it says weapon oh, uh, the shivs these things weapon carving this is only carving so it could combo with its swords this is very bad by the way it costs one energy and deals pre pretty much almost the same but less damage because it covers two rows for one damage each instead of covering one row for two damage each which obviously one row with two damage each is better so now that I have the swords as a choice, please sell this. And please sell this too. I won't take more items. What? Boo. 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 <laughs> let's go here. Let's go here. Let's use a shiv. Let's use another shiv. Let's use a free helmet. And uh, let's mark the front line, I guess. Nice. We can eat this too. I'm not sure if I need it though. Yeah, I definitely don't need it right now. Wait, how many swords do I have? Well, that was a useless attack. The last attack was for no reason. Okay, Shiv. Defend. Draw two cards. Shiv. Draw two cards. Shiv. Perfect. That's what I want to do. That's what I want this build to be. And now this does like 17 damage because of all the things I destroy next to it. Very nice. Man, we were extremely lucky that we got the scimitar early. And we even got it from a flivvy spin thing. Let's get a key. Let's use the key first. Yep. Now let's go to the event. See what the event is. Okay, what is this? A whittling knife. Zero cost rare. Draw a carving. Increase energy cost by one this combat. Okay, okay. Let's try to deck three. Or, let's try to find three or four of these. The first one was a failure. 
Oh, no. What are you kidding right now? Okay, I'm gonna roll until this costs like 10. Yeah, no. Is this a non-curse? When the turn ends gets through it. Yeah, that's, that's a non-curse pretty much. Nice. No. <laughs> Let's put it here. How much more money do I have? Uh, I, I want to keep my money. Let's take these to sell them, I guess. At least they're uncommon. Nope, uh, she does not accept normal items. This guy accepts normal items, but first let's uh, see if there are more rare items here to sell. Okay, energy related stuff. What was this event? Something trashy? Oh, it's the same event as previously, but with trash versions. Armadillo. Let's do this. Let's do that. Let's just drink all these. Just be done with the fight. Hop, hop, shield. Hop. I'll go hop, hop, hop. Dead. Hop, 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 hop. Still alive. Both curses are gone. It's got even damage because of the curses are gone. Shield. Let's not make a mistake. Let's not make any energy mistake. Okay, now it's dead, obviously. Nice. Okay, we found a rare to sell. And uh, yeah, let's go. Is this uncommon? It's also uncommon. Let's take this uncommon too. Is this also uncommon? Nope. I don't even know what's uncommon and what not. Was there a key there? I don't think there was a key there. So we sell this. Actually, do I want dodge? I think dodge is a good idea. Let's sell this, sell this, and sell this. And give me the dodge and have it here. And this can be... I guess nowhere right now. <laughs> I guess nowhere right now. But when we're gonna get a level, it's gonna be better. I'm not sure if little buckler is needed, like, at all. Honestly speaking. But let's go regardless. Wait, I have 54 coins. Where did I find 54 coins? No. Okay, last time, last attempt. Yes? No. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go. <laughs> Let's not gamble anymore. Uh, I need money before the boss fights, obviously, because as you saw, this character has shops in boss fights. Okay, this is not good. <laughs> we have and uh, this is 8 damage. How much is this? 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, this is the same. 9. Even better. Let's go. Question mark is cursed. Let's go. Let's go here. Let's go here. Now let's start smacking, I guess. Well, we're gonna get the curse regardless. You see, the problem is placing it. The problem is not getting rid of it. Boom. Boom. Dodge. Uh, see what we draw. Zzz. Damage even further. Boom, now it does 13. And smack, smack, smack. Pass. Do zero damage to us. Now we should have enough damage to assassinate. Very nice. A energy. Another. Zzz. Let's go with damage too. I would prefer it if it was there. Uh, healing. I mean, no. Okay, let's go. It's going to be down here. This is the shiver line once again. Double bad fight, not an easy fight for us. Another shiv. And also wooden bucklers. Yeah, let's take a shiv. And the wooden buckler. And sell this thing. Nice. I have only two coins. Why did I YOLO into this fight without looking what the fight was? YOLO. The reason is I YOLO. How many of these are in the deck? How many tree swords do I have in the deck? Okay, that's toast. That's also toast. And uh, I can accept one damage. Yeah, because I don't know if I... Well, I, there was no need for me to accept the damage. I should, why did I not use the shield twice? Who knows? Draw two cards. Shivs. 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 Easy win. Nice. And we found a letter. And we find a tunic for a good old for energy. So maybe throw the slash shield away, get the tunic. For that very reason. I mean, I can also have the slash shield for that. Honestly speaking, I need like an area up here to throw these things in there and just let them be. But for now, I, I guess I can go with what I already have. Let's go with, uh, let's see what this guy's selling. Nothing of importance. Let's see what carving we can add to the deck. Ooh, what is this? Cherry bomb tin, tin, tin. can be placed over other items. On use, weapons behind get three harm and bonus damage. 
but the weapons behind this are used and they are destroyed. Okay, so that's another payoff thing. Nice. Rock Magician Boots. Can replace the other items. Adds one block. For each mana stone above this, this gets plus four block. So wait a minute. If you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If you have eight, eight times four. Yeah, it's like three two block with only one item. That's insane if you're a mage. I'm not a mage, so it's useless to us. But it, it, it is insane for sure. Let's, uh, let's not take any of these. I don't want to destroy my items, and I also don't care about the rest. What is this shop selling? Mana stone. I guess fair enough. Let's go executioner. Is this guy not gaining spikes on take damage? Okay, shield. We should also attack him, by the way. And uh, here. Okay, pass. I don't take enough damage. Wait, how much? Oh, I gain free shield from this. Wait, why do I gain so much, though? Spike, 13. This is also 13, so let's scale it. Uh, I guess I can just block. Yeah, I guess I can just block twice. I don't need to... I, I don't need to be any rushy. I'm in, in no rush whatsoever. 15, dead. You see? I can slow play this and then just take the opportunity when the time arises. Uh, I can throw the tunic away to get the machete for the triple thing. Yeah, like, I can do this. For example. For the triple mana thing. Yeah, that's, that's an idea. Or I can also do this. Yeah, this is a better idea. As to that, three energy when I use the machete up. Executioner again, but this time I don't have the defense. Oh, that's an instant regret. Smack. Smack. And uh, how many defense? I, I can only block once, so let's go here. Might as well smack two times. I mean, I'm dodging everything anyway. Okay, shield everything. He has 22 life. He's doing 21 damage. No reason to play this. No reason to push my luck. Smack. Done. No life lost. Very nice. I got this thing, but I also have the double halberd for the energy thing. We're gonna keep the machete. Let's see what we find. I see the bat up there. I remember the fight. Okay, as long as... What is that? Uh, I want this. Just out of... Just out of curiosity. It looks awesome. It looks the most awesome thing. What is this? Dreaming sword. Oh, come on. This has to be for this build. Uh, add three damage for each carving play this combat. Oh, okay, you're out. Join us, Dreaming Sword. Join us. Look at this. Look at this madness. So it does nine base. Okay, so this thing's base damage is five. This thing's base damage is seven. So the difference is two. But this thing is gonna gain three damage every time. So the moment I play one carving, it instantly uh, outscales it. It's gonna go up to eight right away. Uh, while well, this was gonna also go up to 8. But uh, after the second carving. So, uh, first carving and they instantly same damage. And second carving and it's better. Love it, love it. Let's hope we don't die in this bad fight. Okay, let's begin. Kaboom. 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 Also do this. 22 damage is incoming. Uh, dodge it. There's a good chance we're gonna kill anyway. Okay, let's go. Kaboom. Kaboom. And now the street exploded. Nice. No. Um, okay, I'm killing this guy. And this is not enough. This does 26 damage right now. Let's go. Boom. 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 It uses it even. And then another 44. And that's that. That's that. Uh, okay. So, first of all, I want this. So that I can play the sword in this slot. Second thing... I want to start opening up like a path here or here. I would say we open up an area here so that I have my 4x4s over in this corner. Yeah, like the 4x4s here. Uh, this can yeah, this can be in the ground. It doesn't matter. I mean, I'm playing the shield on that spot anyway. My 4x4s need to be up there, as I said. Here, you can also be there. Actually, here's my 4x4 boom. And the shield can be down here. If it's needed. And I think we're good to go. Like, I use this on demand when I get the... <laughs> when I get my sawmill powers. Okay, I think we're good. So I play the shields here. They still get the full benefit. This still buffs the whole idea, the whole line. And uh, yeah, I play the shifts here and it has a whole line of attack. That's it, pretty much. We're pretty, pretty much... We're pretty much made. 
This is the build fully executed. Now I made a mistake and don't have money in the bank as a backup. And I also made a mistake. I didn't bring with us items for the shop here. Yeah, that was definitely a mistake. Why did I throw away my weapon, man? Why did I throw away my weapon? This was a rare one. I would have gained money. Because now there is going to be a shop here guaranteed. <clears throat> here it is. And what is it? And what does it sell? It is this and this. So this is hero carving. For zero cost, carving legendary can be played over other items on use. First of all, it's a zero cost. On use, items behind are used. This carving is banished. Okay, so if I use this, it uses the item behind for free. And it's a zero cost. Banished means it just goes away from the deck. I love it. It's really good and cost 10. And what's this? Can be played over other items. On use, all connected weapons get 100% bonus damage. Yeah, but for how long? For how long is the bonus damage? This is really good, by the way. For one energy, gain double damage. Well, I'm gonna take this for now. I'm gonna take the use an item for free. And uh, if I can come back after the boss fight because I have money, then so be it. Uh, I'm gonna start scaling the Dreaming Sword. So, yeah, we're not gonna be damaging for a while. Uh, let's go draw two cards. Nice, I got a Shiv. Uh, might as well use this to get it out of the deck. And at the end of the day, it's just a, a carving anyway. Okay, let's go onwards. Okay, shield. Uh, I would say kill the smaller guys. Shield again. And now I, now I have enough energy to also start using the Dreaming Sword. I think that's the play. I play just whatever carving arrives. Okay, here we go. Uh, let's go. Boop. Boop. And now we have 3D damage. Hop, 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 hop. Attack! Like this is the this is the play. This is the play. We just play whatever we draw. It doesn't matter what it is. Oh, that was a misplay. Here you go. Shielding. Here you go. Shield and smack. And after we're done with everything, then we start using this. What is this? All weapons got this effect applied on use. This item is anchored. No. Dream frog. Uh, no, I don't have energy. And coral. Also, no. I could do this though. And have like three energy up there exist. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go with a coral. In case the coral gets used on the wooden buckler, you know. And in case it works. In case it works. Let's see what we get for free. I will go with the card draw. Yes, I will go for the card draw. Because I have all the shivs in the deck. Uh, I will get the legendary to sell it. And I will also get the damage knife to maybe use it. Uh, on take damage haste. I mean, I can also take that to sell it. Uh, let's put it wherever. Mm, did I get enough money? I'm at 7. I don't have enough money. And once again, I cannot sell these on the shop. So, that is what it is. I want to remove the, the last blade I have. The one energy, two spot blade. Fire Gecko fight. Let's see how this is going to go. Okay. Uh, first of all, I got the... So, let's uh, the fish throw that way. I guess I can just use this twice. Yeah, I can go... Do I have defense here? Yeah, I'm going to use this. So, I can go 1, 2... Okay, then this... Okay, now this. Okay, we're gonna use this anyway. And we're gonna go hop, hop. Okay, that's obviously not enough damage, but this guy's curse is not gonna be that relevant, so I can accept it. Yeah, region to opponents. It's uh, completely relevant to us. Take it. Throw it away. Okay, this curse is also gonna be relevant. The only thing that actually doesn't matter is kill the right guy. So we're gonna go a one, a two, a three. Okay, and actually, I, I made a mistake. No, I didn't make a mistake. Here, give him rage even. He's not going to survive the upcoming attack. I'm doing 25 damage and I have 3 energy. Uh, Well, if he survives or not is irrelevant, as I have 40 armor anyway. <laughs> shivs. No shivs, but a helmet to get rid of out of the deck. Yeah, but I didn't lose anything. And he's toast. Shiv. Boop. Dead. Nice. Nice, nice. We're gonna get energy, and we're also gonna get the key. There is a reason why the energy is here because it's gonna get buffed by the plus four damage. Uh, the key is for that. Let's see what the event is. Damage, obviously. Haste. Thank you very much. You stupid enemy. Let's go haste on the little buckler. <laughs> Swift becoming crazy for no reason. We're gonna go energy, and uh, I want to first kill this guy because the right guy is easily blocked. Well, the left guy is most likely going to kill us. Double defense. I use double defense because, obviously, it also used the weapon. Okay, we got it. But do I want to use it? I mean, I want the money, but I guess I'm not going to use it. I don't know. We're going to take a bunch of damage here. 
I'm gonna dodge the 22 damage incoming. I'm gonna do this. And uh, I guess we're gonna do this. And damage. Yeah, that's enough. We're gonna take a bunch of damage here. Dodge the 22. Take the poison. Oh, that poison's gonna kill us in the two turns. In two or three turns, we're dead. Here. Here. 25. Okay, you're dead. And... Uh, are we dead? Are we dead? I think I have to go shield, shield. Okay, shield, shield is the play. Nine poison. I need to heal right this instant. Boom. Boom. How much is this? 31. 31 times 4. 31 times 4 is definitely enough. Very nice. Okay. This is a rare that I can sell. And also a rare that gives will give us a bunch of energy if I use it. But I don't know. Let's go sell a bit. Let's go sell. So you're out. Um, you are out. I guess I bind the energy. I, I definitely buy the healing. I want to keep the lightning just because of the... Um, I want to keep the lightning just because of the energy thing. Uh, let's also take this. Why not? I mean, I do have money. Let's see what the carving is selling. Ooh, what is this? A legendary. Belt of Dream. A rare. And a relic. Weapons in this column get this effect applied in this combat. On use, this item gets plus one damage in this combat. Ooh, it's the, it's the stopwatch effect. Okay, we take that. And she's also selling a shiv, so we take that. And we sell this. And uh, we take the pot. And I think we're good. I think we're good. Fire Gecko, Fire Gecko. Let's first see what else we can find. Okay, we found another pot, and we also still found the tip carving. Well, the tip carving is irrelevant, so let's get the pot. Let's see what we find here. A scimitar and an assassin's weed, but what we care about is the golden redstone. Let's hope... Uh, so the very left was the very left. Let's hope they didn't change that. Oh no, I think... Okay, nice! We got by far the best item we could have gotten. The golden redstone. Uh, double fire gecko fight against snake and fire gecko. Snake and Fire Gecko is... Harder. Let's go double Fire Gecko fight. Wait a minute. If it was harder, then I should have gone there first. Zero logic sometimes. Let's... Uh... I think I don't need this. I can go here. Yeah, okay. This is uh, not enough damage. Let's try to get rid of the next curse, I guess. Okay, this does. 21 damage. Let's go. Bye-bye. Okay. The curse is irrelevant. Here. Rage. Whatever. Okay, the curse might be relevant. I'm kidding. It's not gonna be relevant. Kaboom. 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 And now you take 24. 34. 35. Yep. Nice. I love it. I love it. I love it. And we found healing. And we found energy. And we found energy. Uh, might as well have these around this for damage in case they trigger. Uh, yeah, hopefully we're gonna destroy the next fight. Actually, should I get more healing instead of one more energy? Yeah, let's get more healing instead of one more energy. Is there a key here? No, there is no key. Let's go fight the snake and the gecko fight. It should be pretty hardish. Uh, actually, we can allow the gecko to survive for a moment. Okay, that's a free weapon use. We can go... Do I have defense? I have this. Let's go here. Wait, what was that? Okay. Draw two for shivs. Nice. Go, go, and this. Okay, let's shield away. That's 13 damage. Snake is obviously dead. I like how I have the lightning helping us. Kaboom. Kaboom. Are you kidding me? Well, 3d8. <laughs> shield. Go. Woody one. Well, that's rage. As long as you don't gain spikes, my dude, it doesn't matter what you do. Let's get the boost. Let's use this. Let's use that. And you take 52. Okay, we are scaling extremely fast. Extremely fast. Is there a key door that gets needed? That is needed. Is there a key that's needed? By the way, where is my... <laughs> where is my... Uh... I, I I remember that I had that. Oh, we found cruise energy. Let's go. Let's go. That's actually really good for us. Um, I would say we go and sell the lightning. Forget the right now. Let's just get the money in room. Here you can... Wait, what? Did I get that? Drag to sell. Take it. Crimson Energy is here. Now we actually have an active Crimson Energy. 
you can go here nice now we have no downside in um yeah now we have no downside right now damage wise let's hope we're gonna beat the boss here uh, i'm not even fighting the boss nice let's hope the boss is not gonna be uh king because king is gonna kill us up energy energy yeah this is obviously a boss fight so we want to expedite what we're doing okay shiv sword shield use this attack 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 nice I like how we're scaling extremely fast. I really enjoy that we found the legendary dreaming sword for this build. I really, really, really enjoy that. You're toast. Let's get rid of the front line too. 17 damage per pop here. Shield. Bye. <laughs> Shield again. Bye. <laughs> Maybe I should have the little buckler next to the dreaming sword so I can use it. Boom. Boom. Draw two cards. Here you go. Here you go. Still alive. Bye. And we're still shielding everything. The, by the way, I'm scaling energy. Please don't. Throw. How many swords is the? I I don't understand how many swords the deck has. I really don't. I really don't understand how many swords the deck has. Um. Yeah. How many swords the deck has? Here you go. Boom. Seventy-six. Dead. Boop, boop, dead. Nice. Nice. We are extremely powerful. Ah. Uh, I guess I can take this for the four hand, but the but the isn't even appearing anymore. We're just drawing normal swords, I guess. Uh, let's go to the shop. Okay, she is uh, selling a pot carving, which I care about. So let's take it. Is this still the mana boots? Yeah, this is the mana boots. Let's go here. Okay, let's sell this. Nice. Let's sell this too. Oh, come on. One at a time. Damn your game. Let's see what we go with. Let's continue. Queen Bee and Blade Master. A yeah, Blade Master is gonna be a problem. Uh, let's go Shield. I have two energy right now. Let's go Dodge and Regen. Let's go Pots and uh, let's go Kaboom, Kaboom. Continue with the Pots and Kaboom, Kaboom. Man, the Shift deck is insane. I love what we have built up here. I have to Dodge anyway. Up and the other Dodge is gonna go away. Okay, we target the bees. Obviously, let's draw two. Shiv, bye bye B. Draw two. Uh, shield, bye bye B. Let's get rid of this. And we don't take any damage anyway. I need to kill the, the B Master right now because I don't want to get poisoned. Uh, we obviously use this. Shiv away. Ah, oh, still alive. No. Let's go here. Okay, I got a free use item. Actually, wait a minute. I can do this. Nice. And now free use item. Nice. And now I can just dodge. Nice. Everything was perfect. Everything has been perfectly executed. Uh, we're gonna go shield. We're gonna go pot, see what we get. We're gonna go uh, spike. Okay. Shield. Shield. Let's go. I could have attacked again. Eh, whatever. 94 damage. Kaboom. <laughs> Love it. Uh, I want this so that I have this shield down there <laughs> to be able to use it. And then I think I want to just open up space. Right? You know what I also want? I want this spot here. Because I can put the Crimson Ring down here and literally nothing is ever going to go to that spot. Uh, but I want to also open up this path. Let's maybe go here. Yeah, and slowly just... Uh, maybe go here and like open up this path. Next level is going to be here and here and here maybe. Wait, so I should go here so that the next level is these three. Although it looks like very stupid right now, but... It's gonna help. Uh, we found a we found a weapon that we can. It's not even a weapon. Let's get this up here. There is no reason not to have a defense. I want this here. I'm thinking about how I can fit everything. Two block. Three block. Wait, what? Oh, okay. It's empty space below. Well, that's trash. Uh, three block is hardly worth it. Energy is worth it. I mean, when will I even find this um, this thing? <laughs> I'm like, I'm having fun, but am I even finding it? Like, I can the club away for two energy. Keep the key. Let's go. Everything is fine and dandy. This works. This works. Let's go. Mm -mm. I don't have a key, right? I do have a key. Yay! <laughs> Let's go. Mm, let's see what I get first for the carvings. Oh, it's a trap. La Trampa. 
Let's see what we draw. Defense, maybe. No, we did find it. Nice energy. Throw that away. Let's go with another two drawing. Another two drawing. Where's my? How many swords? <laughs> uh, well, I should have just do this. <laughs> how many? Just how many? Here you go. Here you go. Use this for free. And boom, dead. Nice. 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 As this, uh, this is a two sword, so might as well take it to just that way. Let's also get spike generation. Why not? It doesn't matter. I, I can just get whatever random items I want for those spots. Okay, we don't have any defense. <laughs> smack. Smack. I guess. Defend, defend. Yep. Nothing better to do anyway. Okay, how much damage does it do? 16. Okay, first of all, buy. Secondly, buy. Thirdly, here, damage boost and draw two cards. A boom attack for 17. Shield again, pass. Maybe should have killed the B. Maybe should have killed the B. 32 damage right now. Okay. Damage boost. Here you go. Uh, dead. Uh, dead. And dead. I mean, still alive, but... It doesn't matter. 44 damage. Oop. Oop. The more I use, the better. Boom. Draw. Draw. Shield smack. Shield smack. Assassinate. Almost got hit. Wait, why did the dagger draw some? Oh, wait. Seems like... Seems like there is overdraw. Nice. Because for some reason the dagger... Uh, yeah, I used the dagger and it drew. Which uh, shouldn't be happening. So that means that um, it uses them. Okay, you can go here. You guys can fly off. Oh, this is heavy. Forget it then. Forget it. If it's heavy, forget it. I was thinking about putting it up there for a good old uh, buzzsaw. Okay, let's just use a bunch of energy on everything. And just go for a one turn win. Let's go poop. Go poop. Let's uh let's go smacking. 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 Shield him dead. Shield him dead. Okay. Uh I don't even need to use the shield here. I already block enough. Boop, boop, dead. Boop, boop, dead. <laughs> Easy. Easy. Okay, this is not needed. Now I can do this. Because this obviously gives us a bunch of block over here. So that's nice. How much is this? Three block. How much is this? Three block, but also gives one block back. So that's even better. And uh, I think we're good to go. Yeah, we're good to go. My empty... My important empty spots are still empty. Nothing of importance. Uh, I mean, I can get the energy. Why not? Let's go see the other one. And we're about to fight the boss. We're about to fight the boss with the new thing. Let's go here. Actually, let's swap these so this does more damage. And let's also go here for damage. Why not? Fight. I could have also taken the thing that when you eat it, you lose to life, 5 life, but you gain 2 energy. But uh, I opted not to go for... Wow! It's king. Okay, we got the bad fight. Let's see what we get. What is this? For each adjacent fish, this item gets plus one energy. Ooh, on use, adjacent fish are destroyed. Ooh. Wait, this costs one energy? This costs, This should cost zero. Yeah, this should cost zero. Because as I understand it, if, if I just throw it away, it doesn't do anything. So it costs me one energy if I just use it. And if I have one fish, then it, it's, it bound, it's useless. Uh, I would like the buckler, yes. I would like the buckler, honestly. I want to have more bucklers. Let's go shopping. Can I get this sword? Yes. Take this stupid thing. Ooh, a cleaver. Flower and cleaver. All adjacent cleavers are used. Ooh. So you throw it in and boom, it explodes into a cleaver explosion. Love it. Love it. We're gonna get another shiv and another buckler. And let's go. By the way, what is this mana sap? Add zero mana to connect mana network. Did I, did I read this already? I'm not sure if I read this already. For each mana stone in this row, this item gets plus one to mana. Row is this line. So one. Uh, so let's assume you played here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow! For one energy, eight mana for one energy. This is insane, man. Th this character. If you get the items you want, for example, flooring. This is insane for cleaver builds. Although you have to draw it, obviously. And this is insane for mana builds. Once again, you have to draw it, but still, you can on purpose just sell things every time you find the shop and make sure that you only have mana saps in your deck. Although, as far as I know, you have like every starting item four or five times because I, I don't seem to be able to get rid of the stupid uh, <laughs> the thing I'm trying to get rid of. I'm not sure if I should use these. Yeah, let's use Buckler. 
Okay, I think we're good here. Let's stop using things. I need to make sure this guy does not scale out of its unit. Actually, he is scaling health anyway, right? On take damage, spikes and rage on each turn, he gets free regen. Yeah, I need to burst him down. Although bursting down is not going to be happening anytime soon. But I am attacking him for a decent amount, so... As long as I control everything and get rid of the stupid stuff in the deck, I should be good to go. Uh, I, I I want to fight this this with defense, if possible. Okay, got it. This guy's not attacking us, obviously. I know that every time I'm using the defensive thing, I'm reducing my damage, but obviously it's more important to uh, get everything in order here. Are you kidding me with these stupid swords? How many times do I have these swords in my deck? I would really enjoy knowing. <laughs> Let's use them anyway. Oof. I'm okay with taking four. I'm not gonna use dodge for four. I'm gonna use dodge for four to 35. Let's draw two cards. Let's draw another two. Okay, so two cards are incoming, theoretically. Yep. Uh, I can attack once. I would enjoy attacking with this wood, honestly. Mm, attack again, I guess. Wait. Why do I... Oh, because... Oh, I gain haste, he gains spikes. Yeah, I maintain my shield where it is. What is not gaining maintain is his rage. Well, this is insane, obviously. Uh, let's go draw two cards. Okay, shield smack... Spike, shield smack, shield smack, okay, shield, shield, and we won, we won, we actually won, all weapons get this effect and adjacent or diagonal armor is for shield, the items, don't forget that, 25% uh, damage boost though, that's good, but I want to put it in this line, uh, is that a possibility, like, I'm, I'm thinking about, something like this and this and throw this out and so something like that and if i get a level i put the level here and then put this thing here some something like this i think this is better although gaining free defense was fun but yeah 25 percent damage on top of whatever i'm already gaining is pretty powerful and i mean yeah the meme still lives on you know what maybe no 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 the meme lives on with it but at the end of the day this was just providing us with six armor in reality uh let's go on let's go on i can find another tunic let's go into endless let's see how totes is in endless let's go let's go i'm super excited okay we found this thing <laughs> at long last our long lost brother is back how much damage does this do 16, not enough. Let's go here and here. And enemy still alive. But it's a trash curse anyway, so take it. Use it. Kaboom. Kaboom. Come on. Dead. Very nice. 12 damage incoming. Kitty numbers. Kitty numbers. You're not even doing anything important. Here you go. Kaboom. Kaboom. Use this. Bye bye. I love it. I really love the character. I really love the character and the simplicity of it. And that you have a deck and you just go through and just draw things. I found another shiv. Another mana star. Let's get the shiv. I'm gonna make the super shiv deck. Draw shiv, draw shiv, draw shiv. Nothing else. The draw shiv, the draw shiv engine machine with a couple of bucklers in there. Just for the mix. Wooden bucklers that is. Okay, we can obviously just get through here. All that energy we have generated. What do you want? Here, take this away from the deck. Let's go draw two. Stop drawing me the stupid swords. Stop drawing me the stupid swords. <laughs> How many I have? I, I, I'm assuming that I have four, right? It can't be anything else. 51, draw two. I mean, I can use the bucklers instead of using the, the little buckler. I'm so happy that we found the dreaming sword. I'm so happy that we found the dreaming sword, man. Let's go both of these. Why not? By the way, the Dreaming Sword does not need to be here. It can be up there. Yeah, but it wouldn't really change that much anyway. I found the cog. <laughs> I found the... Okay, he's not selling anything of importance. I guess I can heal. Oh, come, on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Here, take this. Take that stupid carving. What is this? Energy carving for zero. Adds one energy. If there is an adjacent item... This item gets minus one energy. Okay, so I need to have an empty spot to throw it in. Oh, that's good. That's literally free energy, right? So I draw it, I just play it, and it's free energy. And it's a carving. 
Yeah, I like this. I like this. I just need to open up one spot to be able to throw it in. And that spot is this corner here. So this is just going to go there. And that's that. This corner here is where this drops. Let's take it. Let's go. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Draw a card. Okay, let's go here. Let's go kaboom and kaboom again. We're going to take the curse, but who cares? Here you go. It's an anti-defense curse anyway. Draw two cards. Uh, shiv him. Shiv him. Throw this out. Throw this on him. Dead. Nope, it's alive. And we're going to lose life. That wasn't fast enough. Let's see how this exactly works. Okay, literally how I assumed it was going to work. Perfect. Perfect. That's a very good item. I'm using energy to not attack right now. 72 by. <laughs> I'm just I'm just caught up in the in this whole idea. Rare. Okay, we take that to sell it. And uh, I don't care about the rest right now. Yeah, let's go here. 8 max health. 5 max health. Let's go here. Sell the rare item. Here you go. Let's go on. <laughs> my my bad saw thing. We are gonna die at some point. It's not like a busted build or anything, but I like the character. Very nice. Oh, the map is also different. I just realized. Let's go here. Kaboom. Kaboom. Come on. Cannot be placed here. Blah, blah, blah. Liar. Liar! Let's go. Okay, defend. Boom. Throw the sword. Right now we are taking damage. Okay, we didn't find us. We're gonna use this, and uh, we're still taking damage, so let's dodge. Up, oh, dodge. Nice. Okay, we found the buzzsaw, but it's useless. I don't have anything prepped for it. Which is really bad. I need to have always something prepped for the buzzsaw. Very nice. I want to also gain more of those dream woods. This thing, exactly. The belt of dreams. We have this column, get the effect applied. Plus one damage. Now that, now we got the tick effect. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, now this is gonna scale. Multiplayer to 150%. Belt of Dreams, plus 3. Shield Spirit, minus 10. Dead from Spikes. Okay. I mean, now I can literally just use Spikes whenever I want. I can use this too. Ho ho ho, outplayed. And it's dead. Nice. Okay, uh, we go here for that thing. Sure, we put that there. And uh, we go here. And here. Actually here. So that I continue opening up this three next level. You go here, you go there. And uh, yeah, now we got room. Now we actually got a lot of room. Like this whole quadruple is, is room. Yeah, we can have these, for example, with us to use them for two energy each. 12 phase and 8 week. I mean, yeah, that's also really good. 12 phase is actually insane. Uh, was there a key? There was a key. So I guess we're not going to take the chocolate, but this is region. So if it's not the chocolate, it's tea. Shh. It doesn't matter what it actually is. Words don't matter. You only have to see what I'm doing. It doesn't matter if I'm saying something different. This is heavy. This is bad. If it wasn't heavy, I would have taken it. But it is. Um, yeah, I cannot take it. Let's go on. Purple slime. Okay, that should be an easy fight. Dagger. Dagger. I mean, I don't know from where I'm taking the example of it should be an easy fight. Yes. Well, take nothing. Region away. Defend. Dagger. Defend. Uh, use the sword instead of the shield. And the enemies are dead. Now we go defend. Dead. Shield. Spike. Defend. Defend. Still alive, but doesn't matter. It's gonna go away anyway. Okay, we found a legendary shield, let's go! And we also found plus two damage on this row, so you can go up here and you can go over here. Boom, plus two damage on that. Uh, this is money, or it's gonna be a good old buzzsaw. Buzzsaw sounds. By the way, I just realized I need an open spot for, to throw this thing in. Yeah, I just remembered. <laughs> Whoops. I guess I want to level this up next. One level here and two levels here or something. Uh, let's see a new carving. Okay, we found the sawmill again. And so we also found the shiv. I'm gonna continue with the shivs. It's the best thing I could draw anyway. Let's take money. Another dreaming sword. Love it. Let's go on. Is there a key here? He is selling a key, but there is no reason for me to pick it up right now. Let's see what the carving is selling. 
This is new. Dreaming Buggler. Uh, on use, shields two spaces away, yet plus 10 block this combat. It's a zero cost. Oh, and it's also not... I cannot place it anywhere. It doesn't have the... This can be played over other items. So, when I play this, I have to play it here specifically. And it's gonna hit this thing. It doesn't say armor, right? It does say shields. Yeah, so I draw it and I play it here. And then this shield becomes plus 10 defense. Ah! Very around around. It's like the acorn, but this at least can be played wherever. And also gives you 4 block. Well, this is for 1 energy. This is for 0 energy. I don't know. Pretty disappointing in general. I don't enjoy it. Pretty mediocre, I guess. Not disappointing. Disappointing would imply that uh, I had high hopes for it or something. Let's continue attacking. I know that every time I use the shield, I lose damage. But I also gain haste. So you lose some, you win some. And at the end of the day, look at this. We even got the, um, the scaling thing. Now we don't lose damage anymore. <laughs> from the Belt of Dreams. By the way, I can have two Belt of Dreams. It doesn't say that it banishes it. I just wasn't lucky enough to find two or three Belt of Dreams. I mean, in general, right now, I have made my deck huge. I added like a million trashy things in it. But uh, honestly speaking, I do enjoy what we're having. I do enjoy what this whole thing is. Even if the deck is trash. Look at the belt. I love the belt. Come on. Change. Oh. Ooh. Wait a minute. Ooh, I'm going to throw away the tree sword. Let's get this. Let's get to speed. Gas, gas. Come over here. Ah, I didn't know that I can do that. I didn't know that I can see my whole deck. Okay, one sword is here between two shields. And after that, two pots are coming in. Another sword is here between two shivs. Okay, one sword is that. One sword is that. I have two swords right now. Okay, I have two swords right now. Like, imagine, now that I'm thinking about it, now that I'm thinking about it, you can definitely abuse this. Like, imagine if my deck was hero carving. Okay. Uh, no, 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 this thing, which gets managed too, and this thing. Only, like, if I only had a bunch of Belt of Dreams as my deck. Belt of Dreams, Belt of Dreams, and Belt of Dreams. And then I guess pots to draw them. And also these things, like energy carving. That could be insane. Pot of pot carving and energy carving. And you're gonna be like, I play the pot, I draw two cards, I play two energy carvings. I uh, Like, two pot carvings and two energy carvings. And you just all the time cycle between them, all the time again and again and again, until you run out of cards. Or like, three pot carvings and two energy. I don't know, man. You can definitely min-max this and build the dreams. Right now, I'm not really thinking about exactly how you could do it. But uh, th there is hopes. Like, easily, easily there is a builder on this. And I found another Dreaming Sword. I literally remember that the other shop was selling it, so I'm, I'm definitely sure about that. Yep, we have like two Dreaming Swords here. Insane. Insane. Man, I love this. I love this character. The fact that you have a deck. I'm not sure if I draw the deck in order, though. That's the thing I have no idea of uh, being true or not. Because now the deck, for example, got mixed up again. Wait. Do I have three swords? Are you kidding me? One. Two. Three. Wow, I have three swords. Why? Talk to me. Oh, yes. Belt of Dreams. Give me this. And uh, buy this from me. Okay. Would enjoy. I don't think I need more wooden bucklers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. Against one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Ah, let's go one more. Let's go. <laughs> see what we find. I found another flowing cleaver. Let's continue with the shivs. Although I should stop picking up shivs, man, I, because I'm diluting my deck with shivs. I, 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 yeah, I'm diluting my decks with shivs a lot. Let's go carving. Let's go here. Let's go here. Pass. Okay, let's go carving. Let's go here. Let's go here. Uh, defend. Defend. 10 poison. Uh-oh. Uh, we're blocking everything other than 10 poison, obviously. Now, this thing is gonna gain double the speed from Dreaming Sword. We're gonna go here. We're gonna go here. We're gonna go here. Whoop, dead. Yeah, look at this. Yeah, Dreaming Sword plus 3D. Shield Spirit minus 9. <laughs> Insane. I have 9 poison, by the way. We're most likely gonna die from poisoning. Let's go here. 1. This is only plus 3 damage. I don't need to use this. I prefer using the, the shield combo. No! We're dying from poison! Don't do this to us. We won, obviously. 
Very nice. Very nice. What did we find? Nothing pretty much. I mean, spikes is a problem, so I have to take the cleansing flame. And uh, I'm not applying debuffs anyway, so there is no downside to it. Uh, let's get energy. Why not? Let's get an empty cap. Why not? Like, literally, why not? It's not common. This is a rare. Man, let's, let's take these or oh, in case the shop is literally right away in front of us. That's wrong. Let's go back. Okay, let's see if we open up with the shop. If you don't open up with the shop, we just throw these right away. I have to say, the run is a bit slower, though. Oh, I do... Oh, no, that, that's not a shop. By the way, look at the map. Tote. And then this thing and this. And he happy and I don't know what. Okay, anything important? Wooden buckler, I guess. And pot carving. I, I, I don't want to dilute my deck further. Throw these away. And just go. I don't want to di dilute my deck further. Let's go here. Uh, draw two cards. I guess... Draw two cards. Uh-oh. 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 We got bad news. I don't want to use this stupid thing. Okay, I just, at least I'm generating spikes, I guess. Uh, I can take the curse. That's like a two-life curse. Who cares? Put it away. Let's use this. Let's use this. Let's continue smacking. Yeah, at least we have 41 armor. Let's go here. Two energy isn't anything. Throw that away. Go boom. Dead. Nice. Let's draw two. Okay, spikes. Defend. Defend. Nice pass. 63 damage. Spike. Defend. Defend. Come on. Defend, defend, defend. Nice. And we won. Energy. Energy. Healing. Let's go. What a perfect draw. Uh, blue slam for... I mean, I don't care about treasures anymore. Let's just go events. Double blue slam fight. I should be able to defeat this in time. Yep. I mean, honestly speaking, this is worse. So let's go here. Shivam. Kaboom. 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 Uh, I don't need armor more than what I already have. Actually, this generates spikes. Yeah, I should have gone with the spike generation. Okay, that's a poison on diagonal weapons. Yep, that's useless. Uh, now I need to kill here. <laughs> No way I do it in time. Come on. The sword use was a bad idea. I should not use the sword. I should never ever use the sword. Give spikes to opponents. Okay, that's also relevant. Nice. Here. Because they remove their spikes slowly. That's why it's relevant. Okay. Next. Hit me. Yep. Poison on adjacent weapons. Also relevant. This is useless because of what I have set up. I mean, here, might as well throw it away. <laughs> Does it only say adjacent? Adjacent? Oh, this isn't that bad. Okay, I need to set my inventory better up, but it's definitely not as bad as I thought it's gonna be. Okay, at least I killed one. Now I can also kill, obviously, the other one. Ow! Ah, I have uh, something. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna... I'm in pain! <laughs> Let's go. Easy win. Okay, let's have these away from the corner. So I put the energy either here or here or here. I found a rare to sell. Nice. And I find another rare. I oh, know that's uncommon. And let's also heal. And is this energy? Yep, that's also healing. And let's also heal even further. Let's see what the event is. Useless. Blue slime. Ah, we want to go for that. I also want to go for the event though. Okay, let's also do this. And, uh... Was there a shop in the map? No, I'm about to go to shop next. Let's go here, here, and smack. See what the curse is. Yeah, the curse is the worst one, I guess. I mean, the worst one doesn't mean anything. Oh, that was stupid. Yeah, it doesn't mean anything if I'm doing stupid stuff. Well, I have to dodge here. There is no choice in the matter. More spikes. I mean, I'm gonna take it. Okay, let's give them the spikes. Let's go with shielding first. I'm not gonna use the shivs because they're gonna make us lose more life than gain. Oh, we got a problem. Yeah, I'm not gonna use the shivs regardless. At long last, the crystal doesn't do anything. Okay, that literally does not work right this moment. Are you kidding right now? 
yeah, we'll continue gaining my defense. Okay, that's a non-relevant curse. Like, actually, it's like 3 damage, but whatever. I have to use it to not lose life. Mm, shield. Okay. But, yeah, at this point, we won. At this point, the opponents no longer scale that much defense. Let's go shiv and shiv. Nice. Dead. Next. What is this? Damage to cell phone weapon use. Who cares? Uh, shield, 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 come on. And I'll just go through with damage. Can I get my dreaming thing? I mean, this is not able to get activated again. What, what? Spikes, spikes. Tell me that this works on curses. What? Just what? This character is busted now. <laughs> that specific item is even more busted. The, the thing I just got. Let's go here, sell this thing. Mm, ooh. Ooh, token of energy. Ooh. I want this. Okay, let's throw away the iron helmet. I know it's defense and all, but I can also gain defense by using defensive stuff. Here we go. Token of energy. Let's go. And uh, this is regen, which I want to use. <laughs> Why is this becoming red-eyed? Also, this is energy, which I want to use. I think we're good to go. Free item. What is this? Brother's bow. Can be played over other items. Bows behind are used. Oh, so you drop it like that into an, uh, in a row of arrows and shoots them. It's not good. One energy to use up to three arrows. Oh, it says bows. Wait, 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 wait. This is busted. So you can have three bows and a bunch of arrows, and then you can throw it like that into three bows, and all three bows are gonna get used with one energy. Wow, this opens up path for new builds. This literally opens up the path for um, for triple bow builds. Not arrows, okay? I am mixing up the words, but right now I'm not mixing up the words. Not arrows, bows. This opens up the path for a triple bow build, and then who knows how many arrows. I mean, I guess you're still gonna have three arrows because all bows are gonna hit the same. But uh, you can hit this, and it's gonna be insane. Wow. Imagine having five or, or six of these into your deck, and you use the bows by using this. Man, that's... I'm so excited about this character. Unknown event. Uh, I'm gonna take the gamble and go fight the bat. Although, it's gonna poison us and we're instantly gonna die. You know what? I don't wanna die from poison. Just just go on. The bat has like 900 life. There is no chance whatsoever I do 900 damage. We're instantly gonna die from that. The poison, that is. Armadillo crossbowman. Maybe we're even gonna die here. Who knows? Throw these away. Regen, regen. And let's go spike. Let's go defense. Um, I guess let's continue spamming defense. Do I have enough? Yeah, this is 60-something. Let's dodge once. And from the next turn onwards, maybe we're not going to take that much. Okay. So now we're taking 70-something. This goes here. Maybe we're not going to take that much. Famous last words. Let's continue smacking. And are we going to die here? Up, oh, up, oh, dead. It is what it is. It is what it is. We were expecting to die one way or another. Um, so yeah, I guess uh, I could have survived if I pressed more defense instead of playing the dream ward thing But please remember that uh, not only I but also opponent scale So I could have definitely survived here I could have definitely survived here But it would be the one or the other right the moment I got to a snake fight and a poison was gonna come in We would die the, this this character is very slowish, but I like it I really love the new legendary and I really like the, the bow thing we found like that bow thing is gonna be insane so, yeah, I think that's going to be it. I'm not going to do a quick, a big outro here. What did we try? It just pulls us back in. Yeah, it just pulls us back in. So, uh, let me just showcase the starting equipment. So, we start with, um, let's see, one, two helmets, two shields, three swords, three... Sh Wait, that can't be my starting equipment. This cannot be my starting deck. This is a lie. This is a lie. I can guarantee you this is a lie. How, how did I get three and four different helmets when I was playing previously? There, there either are some bugs and also three swords. And I sold like 50 swords to that lady. Like, how, how did it happen that I had so many swords? Yeah, this is definitely not the starting deck. So, something is wrong. Maybe when you get levels, it adds on purpose trash to your deck. Maybe the removing of things is not registered. I don't know. I don't know. This is still a, bu a buffed. Uh, this is still a beta build anyway. So any bugs will get cleaned. But I enjoy the new character. I enjoy the new mechanic. I enjoy that you're playing the game normally, but you also have the side thing. Now I don't enjoy that she almost overshadows uh, the the um, the rat. Uh, the rat starts with three energy, and that's it. 
she starts with one energy then goes to two then to three then four then five so in the first two turns yes maybe the rat is better but from the third turn onward it's almost the same although from the fifth turn onward most of the time the opponents also be start scaling very quickly very powerfully so maybe it's a um, it's a mixed bag on that but because she has the sidebar to use more items she isn't actually worse because yeah you might say first turn she has one energy but if she uses that one energy to use a 17 armor shield because she has access to it or when she uses that one energy to throw five or four ships that all the ships do 15 damage for free like yeah okay she has one energy but she also has a sidebar that have like a million different effects that give her more energy or give her more shielding or give her more damage or give her a bunch of things so right now it feels like she's a bit better than the rat i think the rat should have four energy <laughs> uh, you know my, my my way of fixing things that are not fair is buffing things that are weaker anyway that is going to be it for today i hope you guys enjoyed i would really like to hear opinions on this whole thing i, I really like this character she she seems awesome and uh yeah hopefully i mean i'm gonna play with her even more now for people that hate me using mods i'm not gonna use mods for a while man i already mentioned it five or six times and then i'm seeing in comments people being like you know what i don't like you using mods forget me i'm out <laughs> you're never gonna hear from me again okay bye bye man <laughs> I guess if you don't hear to me me saying that I'm not gonna use mods, then I guess I'm not I don't have an issue not hearing from you again either. So yeah, thanks for watching everybody. Thanks for being here. Thanks for all the Patreon and membership supporters. And if you also want to support me, just drop a like, boys. If you drop likes very quickly, the moment this drops, we're gonna have we're gonna have uh I don't know, maybe it's gonna become viral. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. So once again, thanks for watching and see you guys around.